you guys happy friday i am so excited so i just have to celebrate for a second the fact that facebook live has been working for me finally i was having so many problems with it and now we are just streaming live so easily i'm so grateful so i wanted to hop on today and talk to you guys a little bit about the importance of self-love and real quick i'm just going to hop on uh, my computer and share this inside my private group freedom babes if you're not already in there you can feel free to join i will post a link for that a little later on um, but if you're hopping on say hello i'm just hopping on my computer real quick and sharing this video a few places let me know what you guys have planned for the weekend it is friday i'm so excited um, i've got some family things planned myself and I really have a one-track mind, you guys, so as I'm sharing this and trying to talk to you, it's not working. So bear with me for a sec. Alright, so today I want to talk about everything in your life, every change you want to make, every improvement, really starts with how you feel about yourself. So as humans, we are always continuously growing, evolving, learning new things, trying new things. Um, and if you don't know me, I'm a spiritual life coach. I help women discover freedom and abundance in their lives and really start to transform every aspect. I focus a lot on money, mindset, um, and self-love. So today I want to talk about self-love because I know that it is the key to everything else. So unlocking everything else in our lives really begins with how we feel about ourselves and i did a little bit of research on this earlier today i asked you guys raise of hands who feels like they need more self-love in their lives so far the reactions have been incredible for that so i know that a lot of you are struggling with this and it's something that i've worked on myself a lot it's a continuous process so like i said we are always growing and evolving learning new things but what i wanted to remind you of today is that we are always starting with ourselves so however you feel about yourself whether you love yourself hold on he's eating the tree hey you no tree please no tree whether you feel really good about yourself or if you're still working on it that's going to reflect on how you feel about everything else in your life and your growth in every other aspect excuse you <laughs> so i'd love for you to comment below and let me know on a scale of one to five how you feel about yourself whether you feel like you really love yourself at a scale um rating of five or if you have some improvements that you want to make on a level one so comment below let me know so that I can get some feedback for you from you guys um, right now I'm working on some really incredible things all around self-love and I cannot wait to share them but I'm not going to release any details on that yet what I wanted to give you guys today is a really simple exercise that you can do today um, or any time that you have a moment um, that can help you begin to really practice some self-love and it has to go along with gratitude so I talk about gratitude a lot it is the easiest way to shift your mindset um, every single week in my private group we practice gratitude we have an entire day dedicated to it and I personally practice gratitude every single day so that means being thankful for the things in your life now today when we're talking about self-love i want you to take a second and focus on what you are grateful for about you so that means sitting down writing in your journal in a notebook wherever and this is a super simple exercise it doesn't have to take too long um, but it's a really great way to kind of get yourself centered and focus on where you are at with your self-love um, it's a great way to start practicing gratitude so writing down so easy you guys i am grateful to myself for myself because dot 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 and fill in the blanks so these can be so many different things and what i want to remind you of is that i am statements are incredibly powerful so if you are walking around and saying i am ugly if you're saying i don't have confidence um all of these i am these definitive declarations are really going to determine what your subconscious mind thinks about yourself. 
So practicing gratitude for yourself, writing it down in the physical form and continuously practicing that is going to start training your subconscious mind to really begin loving yourself. It's so easy, it's so simple, and it's a really great way to practice some self-love. So if you're hopping on, say hello. If you missed this tip, you can always catch the replay. And if you're a replay watcher, type replay in the comments so I know to give you some love after this video. Um, but we're going over a really simple exercise to begin practicing self-love, and that starts with gratitude for you. Um, another thing I wanted to share with you guys, and I'm going to hop on my computer again for a second, is that I have created a really simple four-page workbook um, for creating a 2008 vision. So we're going into the new year, we have all of these things that we want to do, and it can be a little overwhelming. So I put together a simple couple of questions with a worksheet um, that I used for myself that I wanted to share with you guys. So I'm going to put that in the comments right now. And if you have already signed up for that, give me a happy smiley face, give me some hearts and likes so I know that you guys are on the list and have received that PDF. I'm so excited to share it. I'm just going to comment on my computer here real quick. <laughs> and Connor's going to sing you a song. All right, so there's that in the comments for you guys. Um, but I would love to hear your feedback once you've created your 2018 vision, you've done these exercises, um, how it went for you, what things you've come up with, if you have questions about anything. I do have a private support group, um, and when you sign up for this worksheet, you will have access to that. Um, it's right on Facebook. You can get access really easily. All you have to do is request. And that's your way to get direct access to me um, for some coaching and some support. So I hope that's helpful for you guys. I would love for you to share this video if it resonated with you. If you can think of a woman that maybe needs some help with self-love, maybe you can help her with this message too. Um, and I really hope you guys have a beautiful weekend. So take a second over the weekend to write down why you are grateful for yourself, what you love about yourself, um, and just enjoy the weekend. So that's all I have for you guys today. I will chat with you soon. Mwah. Yeah, you can say bye. Say bye.